But um, the very interesting thing to know that the Maya calendar and the Runa calendar of Chinese they can be nearly 99.9% the same. Yeah, because the authority, the one that brings Maya calendar to the West, uh, he, he come and talk to me about making a lunar calendar. And I sit down with him and go through the whole thing, they are the same. That means before I go, they already tell me the history that a lot of Maya, old Maya people speak. Chinese. They speak Chinese. Okay? And you know why? If you make one line from China to Mexico, that is China and Maya, one straight line, the trusses across the, the ocean. Okay? And that is Maya connection. And they have a lot of culture. So we don't know. But the Chinese calendar is started at 4,701 years, so it's going to be 4,702 years, okay? And when they make the calendar, that time they make 10,000 years calendar. So, now we have 4,702, and how many years we still have to go on? So, I think we have five, more than 5,000 years to go on. So, be happy. <laughs> <laughs> so be happy, and if you want to watch the movie of 2012, don't worry about it. Anyhow, we um, will be a very next year will be what we call by uh, Golden Dragon Year, and the Chinese think that this is a very important year. We have only one in the 60. Okay. So that is a um, quite special year. And um, let me, for me, you know, uh, when I studied with my master, uh, I think that's uh, 40, yeah, nearly 50 years ago. And when my master mentioned to me about the microcosm, a functional and governor channel, and he also mentioned to me the North Star controlling the North Star controlling the governor channel. And the um, and um, uh, uh, Herbin controlled the functional channel. And that time I just told you I don't I don't make sense to me what is it. Okay? So one control one star controlling the yang channel, one star controlling the yin channel. And that is, I mean, they know it for many thousand years ago, ago already. That the two star controlling. And yeah, so um, since the beginning of the 2000 years ago, 2,500 years ago, the young channel controlled by the North Star. So everything become advanced. So we have a lot of civilization and a lot of um, uh, discovering and all these things started about two uh, all the all the um, all the, all the um, philosophy, all the belief system, all these things happen start from the two thousand years ago. Okay. And all the belief and, and, and a lot of culture and investment. So when we started to now Especially now, so um, 100 years in this period, everything moved so fast. Okay, and uh, I met with um, uh, Peter Russell. What's his name? I have lectured with him. You know. He's the one who wrote the evolution, and he said if we put the the history of the of the world from the beginning until now in one year, okay. The so whole thing is 364 days. Whole thing that from beginning and um, 24 hours. So all the things happen 
simple math is only one second. Okay. The period that are the fastest thing that happened is only one second. Tick tock level. If you compare to the history until now, so we are moving very fast. Now, the the why we are moving very fast? Because this is nearly the end of the Yang channel, the Yang, and the extreme Yang, and everything are so moving so fast. And now we suddenly turn into Yin, Yin, and um, the Yin channel. That means the turbine already took over. So now the North Star move and the turbine come in and took over. We got three star, so rotating. So now the turbine take over half and half. And every day go back, <coughs> the turbine will get more power over controlling the earth. So the first thing the axis are tilted. Okay, are tilted towards the south. So there are many, many websites they don't know, but they know there is a website they're already talking about that. The sun set to the south. Okay. Because the turbine will tilt us to the other side, 24, 22 and a half degree, the other side. So what happens? That means the North Pole will melt and the South Pole has to melt because the pole are shipping. So now the pole are shipping. So anytime it's shipping, the, the ocean will shake. So we're going to get tsunami, and because it's just like a table, when you, when you move them and you have water on the top, it's going to spill, and the earth will going to quake, because it's a shipping of the, of the earth from, from the north to south, it's a shipping. From the north pole to the turkey, it's ship like this. So all the ice take about Usually take about 500 years, and 1,000 years to melt all. We only go to 500 years. So another 500 years will melt all the ice in the North and South Pole. So expected what? Six meter to 10 meter high. The, the sea has to go to six meter higher because all melting, but at the same time it's forming a new pole. So that water will gradually lesser and lesser again. Until the new pole are shipping, so we can expect the weather changes. Okay. So in the Tao theory is that there will be have all these things happen, but it's ongoing. It's not a suddenly 180 degree earth tilt, north to south and south to north. Okay. And that is maybe happen on the Noah time. Okay. And that's why the world are flooded with water. But we believe that this time is not that way. So be happy. And I hope you that have a very good years. And one thing, uh, the Chinese discovered the orbit. And it's very interesting that the orbit are controlled by the North Star and the Turbine. So my master told me one thing which I never understand until until when I look at the, the, I, I go and watch the movie, 2012, you know? mm -hmm. and I think, oh, I understand what my mother said. This is so long ago, you know, and they say, I don't understand it at all, you know, <laughs> and uh, what happened that way? So, so he told me that if you move the orbit, you will start mm -hmm. to be made, when you move up, there is the North Star, you're connecting to the North Star, when you move down, you're connecting to the turbine, so you find balance. So when the turbine come in, they will be come into yin state. So the yin state already beginning because the turbine already take part of the control of the world. So the first thing we're going to get is yin power will be rises. So, <laughs> so we the first time in the history we have the, the woman prime minister in Thailand. That's the first time. You know? And we have so many prime minister resident now in the world because the turbines are taking over. And the economy will start it to be turning down. Because we are heated too much. It's so high, high, high. Everybody has to be make the increase. The budget has to increase, the sale goal has to be increased, everything has to raise up very high. There are no place to go. So, 
The next period, the whole thing that everybody has to talk about is no growth. That is no growth, zero growth, and that is going to happen. Okay. If the world started to talk about zero growth, everything zero, and everything stable, and that we are beginning the yin chan, the yin period. So economy will be calm down, everything will be slow down, economy will be zero growth, and we can survive. I don't know how. I mean, I I go into Europe and go into America and always talk about economic problem. Why? How can you have increasing every year, salary up every year, labor up every year, everything up every year? Where are you going to end? If you climb, if you climb the Himalaya, you go to the peak. There's still one day you go to the peak, right? But in this economic way, where are you going to go to the peak? If you increase in last year 10 percent, next year you another 10 percent, and now that year you 10 percent, we have no end. So, let's should be give a gold medal for the company say, hey, zero growth, and sustain the zero growth. And everything just stable and slow down. As a world to survive. But if you think that everything has to increase, increase, and increase, increase, and faster, and faster, and faster, then no way. Okay. So the yin channel, the yin star coming, that means we have to calm down. We have to be slow down. Everything has to be slow. The earth still going to move the same. But we are moving too fast. Mm -hmm. yeah. So I um, hope you have a happy new year. And don't worry about 2012. <laughs>